WBC minimum weight champion of the world, Wan Heng Maniothin, extends his unbeaten record to 53 and uh, creating a little bit of daylight now between his record and Floyd Mayweather Jr.'s beloved 50 and L. He defeated Tatsuya Fukuhara of Japan in a rematch. It went the distance again. But when we're talking about these kind of numbers, invariably we have to ask the kind of quality. Now, I am no expert about Mena Yothan, who's got a great nickname of Five Star Grilled Chicken. So anyone who's been following his career more closely than I have, I really haven't been following it at all. I don't think I can watch it anywhere. Uh, feel free to inform me. But when you're talking about 53 and out, of course, Mayweather was often scrutinised on the principle of, oh, you've got a zero, you obviously haven't really fought that many great prime fighters. I'm not so sure whether Maniothan possibly might be guilty of the same kind of thing. Now, Ring TV magazine, or the Ring website anyway, they've actually got Maniothan rated two in the minimum weight division. They've got another tie. Um, let me just get his pronunciation here. <sighs> Thamanun Neontrong. I've absolutely destroyed that, I'm sure. But another amazing nickname, Knockout CP Freshmart. I don't know what's going on with these nicknames, but they're quite memorable. They've actually got him rated number one. He's the WBA champ. So Manny Othin isn't this unified, undisputed champ who's beaten all his top contenders and now he's just adding cream and icing on top of the cake. No, it seems that he's a guy who's got one of the belts, but he's got a younger tie there who some people think maybe is better. Now, the idea of quality in the lower weights being possibly not up to scratch, it does have fairly solid grounding in the sense of the participation levels aren't as high. I know box rec isn't the be-all and end-all, but if you check it out, they've got 181 participants, I think, at minimum weight, 105 pounds. Compare that to middleweight, nearly 1,300. So you've got at least a thousand more participants at 160 pounds as compared to 105. Naturally, you're going to make more talent on average. It's not always the case. A few years ago at Super Flyweight, just 10 pounds north of minimum, we had Naoya Anui, Roman Gonzalez, Juan Francisco Estrada and Srisaket Sorungvisai all crammed into the same division. It was probably the best division in boxing at that point. So the lower weight divisions aren't always just scarce of talent. But generally, and looking at this case as well, a lot of these guys, just purely by numbers, don't seem to have fought very much. Some of them may have come from kickboxing, often happens in Thailand. You've got a question, what kind of quality Many Othans 53 and 0 is? Again, if anyone knows his career, feel free to inform me. But nonetheless, it is significant. He's had the WBC title since 2014. He's defended it pretty consistently. He's 33 now, which is old for a, a minimum weight. But like Mayweather said, numbers don't lie. Many Othan's numbers don't lie, so I'm going to keep reporting them.